Hi, it's Mrs. Mesh. I'm going to show you how to create a brochure using Google Drive and your Google Document Creator. Um, so you can use that for any of your projects that we do in class. To do that, first you're going to go to your Google Drive and you're going to go to Create and Document. Now give your document a title. Now, um, when you're working with Google Docs, they don't have columns. So in order to, do, to create columns and make a brochure, you have a couple steps that will make it easier. So first thing you're going to do, you want your page to be set up in a different orientation. So you're going to make it a landscape orientation and make it wide. Now what we're going to do is insert a table. And you can decide if you want it to be a a bifold brochure or a trifold. So we're going to go for trifold here. Now, what I, I know this seems very small, but we can make it bigger to fit our paper. And as you fill content in it, it will also make it larger. So I'm going to take this as far as I can just to show you. Um, so it's ideal to take it down to the bottom of the page. I'm not quite there yet. There we go. And so then when you are done, you can try fold it on the lines here. Now, um, to create the brochure, let's say, for example, this is a brochure in Frank Lloyd Wright. Um, all you're going to do is type in your contact. <laughs> let's fix that. Okay. Um, and to, if you want to change your writing print color, just highlight it. You can make it all types of sizes. If you want it centered, just go like that, underline it. Um, you also can change the color of your writing. So to insert a photo, you just click insert image and it should be an image you've already saved. So I'm going to show you that. So I'm going to, to put that there. And obviously you can modify that. And then you could put your content explaining about Frank Lloyd right there. And then your second column, you could do the same thing. Let's say you were focusing on falling water. And obviously I should do uh, how to modify your fonts and colors. Center, underline. I'm going to make a little the same size as the other one. Okay. And insert a photo just here. Again, just save it in your thing. And there you go. So um, if you decide that you want a front and back brochure, you can make um, two of these and make it two-sided when you print it or just staple them back to back. So again, this is a trifold brochure um, and you could put more content over here too. And again, if you wanted to uh, make it two-sided, just make another one of these and you can line them up back to back or and try printing them that way if you'd like. If you have any questions, just let me know.